The Medina Zungo Junction in Accra used to be a scene of several acts of indiscipline ranging from the haphazard parking by commercial drivers, street vending along the highway, to careless road crossing by pedestrians. The Greater Accra Regional Minister Henry Quarte, together with the Lankwantanan Municipal Assembly, took steps in ensuring the area was cleared of all such activities. During a visit to the area on Monday, Henry Quarte expressed agitation at some recalcitrant traders who were taking their activities to the streets. <laughs> Why? After clearing of unlawful structures and the cleanup of the choked gutters, Henry Quarty advised the motorcycle riders along the highway to move from the enclave by Friday to ensure free flow of traffic. So they are mass spread over and yet, and to move from one corner and make it a station somewhere here so that it will be at the back of the house. And yet, 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 up to Friday, and yet, 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 and he also charged the Medina Divisional Police Command to ensure commercial drivers do not park indiscriminately along the highway after a diversion lane was offered them to offload and pick up passengers. Let's maintain this for about one month so that they get used to it. So all churches will go through this side. But as much as practically possible, no on the streets. They have to go through here. So after one month, they will get used to it. Then we can open the side. The challenge is when they pass through this, then they have to exit through the station. The station at the Zonga Junction there. So they can only exit through that station. Then you also have to get a diversion sign here. Yes. So I've spoken to the coordinating director about it. Uh, where's, where's the I'm here, sir. So we need a signboard here. Yeah. And even that side so that it guides them before they get here. They do the sign. You know, but I think that for one month, let us try as much as possible to close this side so that they can all go through. Uh. The minister further moved to the Boshe market at Medina where traders who undertook their businesses along the highway were relocated to and assured them of a joint effort with the Coastal Development Authority to develop the market to facilitate their trade. The <laughs> Na na the yesu sun se ehina mo da ko 
na ye nya mi ti ese ah nyina ye 22 acres of land ah mo betu me di dwa kama kama o ha enti ene me ba ya de di kan me jina ye mc ya nem e de asida mamu se o ka se mu fi kwan hunu ma ti ase ma ba na ma ba ha be hu se de ti e me ni koda fo be kasa enu me ni ya na ye me hwe na ye ncc shirts ni bi e mamu me me ma o ma no up to friday ya on market no pe be bi amamu nyina friday me sa ba ha na na ima yesro be be bi mo mu nyina no mu tumi adwuma se bi se bi mo wa kwa na mu ti ewie nu ti mo manage kakra na me 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 we bi e ma mu nyina ha na mu hwedwa mo betumi asa ma ya na mu nti no makase tro tro fo na mfa ha nta fe tro tro fo nyina be fa ha enti tro tro na na nka e fa kwan hu no ate da da be fa ya enti mo nko bo na eto ni on ba beto oi Henry Kwate also used the opportunity to deny allegations of being indisposed and thus not being able to carry out his mandate. It's rather unfortunate that uh, people will choose to do uh, this kind of uh, needless propaganda by spreading falsehood. That's uh, my good self has been uh, rushed in an ambulance, I've uh, been admitted at the hospital. I want to put it out there that Henry Kwate is fit, having working. And by the grace of God, I shall continue to work. The Lord continues to be my shepherd. I shall not want. Reporting for City News, my name is Ni Ayukwe Okaina.